All right. So today we're going to try something new. Okay, we're going to try something new today. We've got a dog who is excited because it's the existential food. I always play with existential food. So we have a dog which is sufficiently motivated. And now we're going to introduce a completely new behavior, which hopefully with all the foundations that we've been laying onto him, he should be able to grasp it quite fast. So this is just a carabiner. It could be anything. It could be a coin. It could be a nail. It could be anything that you want to train with. Uh, right now, we're going to do this. So first, I'm going to get him to understand that there is value in this article. So it's just nothing, you just, just, we do a couple of these sessions, okay, nothing great, and now we, okay, so we kind of, the beginning, we mark it with sufficient footprints and we later, yes. So now he understands that there's value in that. See, he's got to now look for that. So in the beginning, you're going to have a dog, yes, that doesn't really understand what the exercise is. So I'm waiting for him to do a little nose bump. Yeah, that's it. Nice. Now, just I'm not adding any command to it because he doesn't know. This is all in the free shaping right now. He's inventing the behavior. I'm just the service boy. Now, when I know that he's reliably learned the behavior, I slowly introduce a little bit of distance. Okay, and now I say nothing. Okay. Now. I introduce a little more distance. I say nothing. When I know that he's sufficiently is motivated by the behavior, as the dog is doing the behavior, suk, I classically start naming the behavior. Suk. Now, the tricky portion is, if you name it and the dog does not do the, do the behavior, you will end up naming the wrong behavior. So do it just before the dog is doing it. Suk. Now, I'll slowly become the inactive handler. I remain motionless. I wait for the dog to activate me. moving around so that I present a different picture but the dog knows the real answer I start to move around I can also do a direct reward so that I get a longer duration on the article this is a conflict He sees the food, he knows the behavior. Sees the food, I mark it. He sees the food, but he's got to go back to the behavior. duration of his indication. So am I going to click? You see? Just a little bit. Slow. So the first time he, he looks at me, I don't mark him. I wait for him to repeat the behavior. One, two, three, four, five. But just don't push this too much because you don't want the dog losing interest. Make sure 
It's funny. Now I'm gonna go behind the dog. Yes. Good. End of the session. A realism out of the behavior. My take out yard. Restaurants close. Yoris, thank you for the T-shirt. 